Bobby. I had no faith in you until I heard you start talking. I, d- I thought Joey had this in the bag for sure. But this is certainly a fight where if Bellator could pick the result, he would be the guy who gets the hand raised, right? Uh, on national TV, it's a big exposure fight for him. Are you enjoying coming in and maybe playing the role of spoiler a little bit? 100%. I I, uh, I have more experience than him, so it's it's interesting. I mean, I've got five more wins than he has. Uh, but, yeah, like like you said, he is the, the poster child. He's the guy they want to build up as a star. But they they it's not like they have zero faith in me. This is not a one-fight deal. They've given me a four-fight contract, and I'm going to uh, let them know on fight number one that I am the guy to build up. You mentioned that you have a, a four-fight deal. I mean, is there anyone in the division? Because this win would immediately put you in the in the talks to be fighting the bigger names in the division, of course, because Joey is such a big name as it is. Is there anyone you would like? I see a smile on your face. I feel like maybe there is someone you're planning on calling out. Well, there are no easy fights, so why not call out a big name? Why not call out MVP? You know, it's just, uh, you know, let's get the ball rolling. If I beat, beat Joey Davis in a future fight, well, why not step up to a co-main event in my next fight? Why not go overseas and, uh, and uh, fight MVP in his home base? So not only do you want to fight MVP, you want to go when the crowds are allowed back, when we're all allowed to travel, you want to go to London, to, to the Wembley Arena, this is MVP's home, and that's where you want to take him on. That's the, the shot you're calling. So one thing about fighting that has just been one of the things I've always wanted to do is travel the world, see the world, and have my fists take me around the planet. So why not go to London and fight him? <laughs>